Hi, my name is Beth Hiley here for Board Game Geek TV at Essen 2013. I'm sitting down with Bartosz Kanafa. Yes, that's me. <laughs> that's you uh, over at G3, which we hadn't mentioned. You were literally, actually, I'm staring at your booth. You were our next door yeah. neighbors this year, which is yeah. nice. You did not have a long walk. <laughs> <laughs> didn't. Yeah. But uh, for your last game to show us today, you've brought us Seven Days of Wester Plata, mm -hmm. which I'm um, guessing is a war game. It's a war game. <laughs> and the game takes place in, in uh, 1939, when the World War II started in Poland. Germans sent uh, Szczesik Holstein, their ship, to Gdańsk, and they attacked Poland. Mm -hmm. and and the Polish officers when were defending the Western Plata Peninsula for seven days, and that's what the game is about. Okay. Uh, so the game is for one to four players. Solo player. Yeah. So always, so so always nice. So always nice. <laughs> um, it's it takes approximately uh, an hour to one and a half hour to finish, and um, um, players. Um, Incorporate the roles of Polish officers um, fighting the, the German troops. So, um, in their turns, players move their officers, so perform two moves and perform one action. An action can be an attack from the round space mm -hmm. or an action on, or a, on an action tile. So, the tiles are two sided, the two sides are for the d difficulty levels, which are free, mm. and there are different morale tracks. So here we have uh, an easy level. Easy level is marked with a green dot. Um, and the action on tiles are um, attack from a, a howitzer, uh, backing of the troops, uh, planting a mine on one of the one of the tracks, uh, rebuilding the the, the wall, mm -hmm. the defensive structures. Uh, rising the morale and supplying ammunition, so taking ammunition. And let me, can I take a guess? I'm mm -hmm. guessing if perhaps this building gets bombed to the point yeah. that these bricks are gone, yes. then that building is gone? Yes, definitely. Right. <laughs> so if uh, the troops attack, for example, the troops equipped with rifles attack from the uh, spaces marked with four. The troops e uh, equipped with um, very big guns. Very big guns. <laughs> I think they are howitzers, <laughs> motor maybe. Um, they attack from the first spaces. So if this unit has an attack value of one, um, here it is. It takes one brick mm -hmm. each turn, each player. In, in the same column. In the same same column. Yes. If two defensive structures on the back are destroyed, the game ends. So uh. before seven days, if if it's destroyed, the game ends and we lost. So, yes, so um, the players play against the game. Here the players perform their moves. Uh, here it's um, something like element of luck, because mm -hmm. we take cards and place them on different, different, uh, on different tracks. For example, uh, this unit should be placed on track C, but mm -hmm. it's occupied, it's placed on track E and it moves units on tracks B and D. Hmm. So the move, the unit here doesn't move because it says here it that no it doesn't movement. move. Uh, the, the unit on D moves by one space. One space, right? Okay. Uh, so as, as I mentioned before, um, the units um, the equipped with rifles attack from the space, spaces four. And the units are attack uh, equipped with with um, how it's are attack from the spaces one. So the player's uh, turn looks like this. You can perform two moves and one action. For example, I would be green and I would move here and here and discard one ammunition mm -hmm. to kill this unit and places right right here. If, the, if there are eight cards, uh, eight, eight unit, unit cards uh, on, a, on this space, the, the day ends and then we take one event card, okay. which, which should be hidden, but they're not. <laughs> uh, so this event card... Yeah, here, let's put that out right in the middle yeah. so we can see it. Show us that we should take uh, a brick, a brick wall uh, from spaces. A, uh, A, C. C and, C and E. e. So it could be nasty, right? 
Okay. Are any of those end of day events positive events? Yes, they are, uh, there are uh, four positive events and four uh, negative events. So um, before the game starts, you choose whether you want it to be difficult <laughs> or you want it to be easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, there are two, two morale tracks. If the units uh, attack you, you lose morale. And on the negative morale, and believe me, it's, it happens really quick, mm. that you, you, you lose, uh, for example, the markers from, uh, let's decide that it's mine. So if it's lost, it's, it doesn't come back later mm. on in the game. So it's horrible. Okay, here you get, you have to distribute between the, player, uh, the players for uh, negative movement. So you can you cannot move uh, by two spaces. You can move only by one. Here you lose your ammunition, and that's really horrible because uh, you have to have ammunition to attack. And so, that's also what yeah, drives the game yes, to end. Yes, yes, yes. Um, and what causes this to move on this track? If there are if there are too many many units on the on the tracks, and the, for example, a situation like here. And, all the spaces are occupied, right? The unit goes here, and the next unit doesn't have any space to go on. Ah! It's it's placed over here on the on the bottom of the pile, and and you move. You move the, yes. Also, you have the cards like Stuka's raids, not here. <laughs> it's always the last one. Yeah, there morale we go. drop card. Ah, so instant morale drop. Yeah. Now I'm noticing that this is here's an end of day event, so this would be a morale yeah. boost. Morale boost, right? Oh, he, here's an air right card, and it takes your one of your morale. It takes a break and moves uh, units, so um, it made it difficult. Now I'm noticing um, there's also, if you manage to do very yes, well... Yes, if, if you go here on an action tile, mm. rise morale, and you rise your morale, you can mm, take a marker, receive extra movement, or receive extra action. Okay, uh, so uh, I didn't finish the player's turn. <laughs> the players move, uh, perform two moves, one action, then the units, units attack, so those unit, units would attack, those wouldn't because mm -hmm. they are, are, aren't on the, in the front Right spaces. space, yeah. And then we take another card, place it on a, on a track. Or it's move not this, yeah. You move morale track. Um, and that's it. Next player starts and that's the game. All right. I thank you so much, Bartosz, once again. That game was a <laughs> For, uh, yeah, seven days of Water Plata. Okay.